politics aside views zako on the like legalization of marijuana uh, i mean uh, having also lived abroad uh the studies are there yeah like the studies have been done world over mm, and mm. they say for medicinal purposes mm. it's good yeah um it, it's like everything you don't take everything in excess mm, mm. you know like even jabba there's a point to not say much eh mm, mm. <laughs> you know what i'm saying mm. so it's that it's alcohol it's medicine everything mm, just mm. take it in moderation ato mazio Yeah, Mazio, yeah. yeah. Mazio yeah. is not good for you by the way. I'll tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cuz um, even the reason I was asking is that there's a very close friend of ours, like the both of us. He's called Muki. Mm. And his mom uh was diabetic. Mm. At some point when the pain used to be too much. Mm. Uh, cuz she was religious, he had to actually convince her that this is what's going to Help. make you feel less yeah. pain. So he even I think bake cookies yeah cookies yeah, for her good. and all that just to ease the pain so yeah. so you're coming from your african background kuna ile like eh hii ni mbaya tulishaambiwa shida tu ni jina unapata tu kuchangia jina usikubangi hii mother njaga eh nyazo hiyo hiyo eh ni uko nasema hiyo jina hizo jina tu ziki you know honestly now you, the whole world is in economic crisis yeah so you also have to look at it as a cash crop yeah yeah even if you don't legalize it for consumption you mm. can legalize it for export yeah yeah but una jua kenya tu kutakuwa na ile ndege inaenda hivi alafu kuna zile ile na iko kando cuz i think hiyo pia inakuwa ga like zile shida za kenya the fact that we are not so unaweza kuacha kulima mahindi wakisikia eh kuna vile tunaweza panda nyaso wale nyaso wale watu watu wengi wako hiyo sasa hamna mahindi hamna unga kumbe watu Chai is its own strength. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, so, so kuna, kuna Kenya, I think ile ni as much as inaleta hii pesa mm-hmm. if like a few people end up smoking it by the roadside then <laughs> it's we always look at the negatives more yeah. than the positives. Uh, yeah. It's a shame but you know the thing is just have a, a debate about it. Yeah. Uh, pros and cons. Mm-hmm. If cons win, leave it. Mm. Pros win, do it. But mm. you should there should really be a national debate. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, alafu nini? Kitu moja la sikuuliza ku vile libonga ya Brookhouse ni friends friends wako walikuwa ga wakutoka shule ama kutoka home? Like who did you grow up with like tight friends? Yeah, yeah, I've got some friends. Yeah, uh, wakutoka shule ama kutoka yeah, home? Yeah, yeah. Ama both. neighborhood. Both. Yeah. Neba hudi liko wapi? Cuz I'm just assuming ilikuwa nah, Karen. You know, you're getting it. Na assume tu ilikuwa Karen. Na ini maybe Karen. Cuz excuse na jua, budako anaishi Karen. Uko ndio ilikuwa. No, no, no. Eh. Uh, nilizaliwa Kileleshwa. Yeah. Then Westlands. Yeah. I love Karen. Oh, Karen ni ukisha kwa mbigi. Basically yeah. Yeah, let me know. Eh, tinaza. Oh, okay. Eh. Kile unakumbuka ni jua kile? Afu kile asubuhi na kufurahisha ama hii ni place gani tumekuja nimejama hii ma building ref ref ni kile is it the shop of Sanani the stair sajo alikuwa aishi huko by the way alikuwa aishi huko kwa bed sita ni bila kwa naongea mbaya moving out of kileleshwa but it's becoming a slum yeah it's become overcrowded sindio yeah but that's the problem with this place like you know even now as you're voting for guys Mm, mm. A place like Nairobi if somebody is not talking to you do your city planning yeah, don't yeah. go for that guy mm. mm. cuz you have guys who have given title deeds in residential areas mm. uh, apartments have gone up everywhere 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 even like a place like pipeline now mm, mm. but then how do include things like sewage mm. water mm. roads mm. electricity so now you have kids having to wake up at 4 am to go to school Mm. Do your jam. Yeah. Instead of you know just a proper normal time because you've packed that place and the road is not wide enough. You've not made the need the exception for the roads things like that. Mm. Or hakuna maji or hakuna nini nini. That's the you are, what this place needs is desperately is city planning. Mm. Mm. Yeah. It's, and Kenyans don't like order. Mm. But mm. Kenyans need order like we mm. need order. Mm. of some sort you know mm. yeah i think si tunakuwa gana ile uh, it's my piece of land what can i fanye chochote kile nita do yeah nah, there so have to what? be there have to be some limits but also like it's also a thing growing up you couldn't just sit in a bus and at you there's but uh, what do you call this 
yogurt, nuts, mm. maize, and then you just sugar cane, mm. you throw mm. it on the road. Mm. You know, there was that campaign, this mayor, what's his name, Dick Wadika, yeah, if you yeah. were in Nairobi. Yeah, yeah. Keep your city clean, like it's your responsibility, you know. Mm. Guys mm. would be beaten up for doing that. Mm. Even the conductor is the one who's, who's nini. Like, there's that thing of loving your place. Like, mm. I don't want it to be dirty. Mm. Keeping your place clean, order. Mm. Like, so, guys Z- like Z- that. Zach has a very funny story of someone, I think, who traveled with his dad. Mm. Yeah. Uh, to, to America, isn't it? Yeah, they went to the, <laughs> the Olympics. What, what year was that, was that when the Olympics was in the States? Then Atlanta. The 90, yeah, Atlanta. 94, yeah. 95. Yes, yeah, so yeah. I went there because my dad used to sell curios, mm-hmm. you know, carvings and things like those. Went to a bunch of guys. So in the evening, they would go to a hotel and eat. So they are served with food, bananas, nini nini. So wakichapa story, kuna msena kulandizi. Hakimaliza, amisha tuma ganda kwa dirish. So my dad is like, hey, what? <laughs> uh, try to imagine like the, uh, the, the, the embarrassment. <laughs> Uh, I, f- okay. I, f- I also think kuna the guy who used to produce uh, Churchill Live before mm. it became Churchill Show. Mm. So some guy called, what's it called? Nyanga, I think it was called Nyanga. So he gave the, like, the same sort of story. Mm. So I'm in the States, I'm in the airport, and then they got like these cokes. So I'm drink coke, nini, nini. I come to work on now, Kali Maliza Twifika Kairu Shakwa Corridor. Hurrah! <laughs> yani kwa nini kwa highway after kurisha kwa highway <laughs> then there is this like really like racist white guy <laughs> just comes next to them and you are telling them to go back to africa <laughs> and all that stuff <laughs> yani. yeah uh, so cuz una, una try to imagine these people don't actually like you yeah and then on top of that una, una yeah, yeah 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 una Americans are like that even like you're asking how life is there yeah how, how life was for you for you no, yeah. yeah americans No, only America. Mm. It's not like UK guys who have immigrants and they've traveled. Americans know only America. Mm. And when you come there as a foreigner, they don't try to understand you whatsoever. Mm. They don't even try to understand how you talk. Mm. Yeah. I remember us, we were taught words even in school here, like color, you know, C-O-L-O-U-R. Yeah. Imagine I'm in university, I'm writing things, I'm losing points on thesis because... I you put the you it wrong yeah i'm spelling yeah. it british english yeah. so you have to learn american english mm. and you have to speak like them for them to understand if they, it's like too hard for them to understand you they just mm-hmm. yeah i think there's even in in one of our live shows there's a guy called nyerere he's uh, based in uh, canada he was saying the same thing yeah like Uh, the lecturer has reached a level where the lecturer just ignores him because yeah. he can't, can't understand him. But at least he knows that he knows what he's saying. Yeah. So he's like, yeah, oh, yes, 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 yes. Yeah, uh, it happens. Uh, so there's that that element. Yeah. But but I think because you'd come from Brookhouse, it's quite easy, Ama. Because what I can imagine, I'm talking. Yeah, but I grew up in Nairobi. Uh, <laughs> like this proposal. <laughs> yeah. I am telling you. Yeah. <laughs> Now you have to uh, try and defend yourself. Like, you know, I come from the land where Obama came from. <laughs> Even though you're pronouncing Obama, which is the right Ob- way. Barack. Yeah. yeah. It's you know, Obama. Obama. Yeah. That's the right way. But I would take you to No. I don't know. Uh, Brookhouse, I said, yeah, because now you're going to be Americans, like, would make no, you... No, 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 M- British. More yeah. British. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, More British. Oh. What they tell you is to speak proper. Mm. I've told you. So, <laughs> not your, yeah. like, how do you say, say my magic, Water. So, you say... So, me would be water. Water. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah, you've been taught to say water. Water. Um, yes. Um, America. Americans... You have to say the R. It's the hard R. Mm. So water. Water. Yeah. yeah. The T is soft. The R is always harder. Yeah. Um, but when you're kids, you maybe you're saying water. Yeah. So Brooke was tells you to say water. Oh. <laughs> mm. Not water. That's mm. what they used to like. They really need the Kenyan, mm. like pronounce mm. it like this. So mm. oh, it's funny because when I'm in America, they say I have a Kenyan accent, and yeah. I come here say I have an American accent. Yeah. Like. You can't win, but the truth is, <laughs> yeah. what you're taught is what they determine as speaking properly, pronounce it properly. Like that's mm, mm. pronounce every, every. But they also correct the English. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Like, so it's just American. Yeah. Like you're speaking funny English, like right? yeah. 
This is our language. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. It's literally their mother tongue. Yeah. So I remember there's a time uh, your dad was called Tinga. Mm. And then he changed to Baba. Agwambo. Yeah. Like and then there was a guambo yeah. and then eh hey, so history about Billy and Zaji and how confusing was it to be in the house <laughs> here seeing some random dude like baba <laughs> how did <laughs> how did that work? I remember that one when uh, <coughs> when he came back from uh, Boston yeah uh, and there was that big rally mm. and it was just spontaneous mm. he was talking and every line people are saying dio baba <laughs> Dear Baba. Yeah. And that's when Baba was was born. Oh. Uh, I mean, hey, the mother Mary. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. No, why? <laughs> when I was a kid. <laughs> when I was a kid. Yeah. <clears throat> you know, you have these relatives who come stay with you or friends or whatever mm. from Shago. Mm. There's one who used to call my mom mom. Mm. I said, man, stop calling her that. That's yeah. not your mom. That's my mom. Uh, but uh, you know that was a kid. Yeah. So yeah. now you learn it's a sign of respect. Yeah. And yeah, yeah it does it can't take away from me. It's, that's mm-hmm. what they mm-hmm. see him as sour. Yeah. Na hii jina Tinga ilikuwa imetoka kutoka wapi? Cuz me hizi jina zote si si nikizifikiria sasa hizi ndio naanza kuzifikiria. Like hata niko ni sawa guizi. So yo yo Tinga ilitoka? NDP. Yeah. NDP was his party in 97 yeah. and the yeah. symbol was a tractor. Oh, ilikuwa oh ndio yuko toka hapo. Mm-hmm. Alafu agwambo, agwambo ina manisha. It's like a spirit, eh? I don't oh. know. It's like a spirit. Mm. And this was after 2002 when the Kibaki campaign. Mm. Yani how did this guy whom he had jailed survive? Mm. Come out took down befriended Moi mm-hmm. took Moi down mm-hmm. and has brought the country this far it was yeah. like his uh, spirit like how did he do it oh kundi agwambo ikatokea alafu time the snoop al come tokea na snoop double she's on in so i guess a guise she's in my knees she's in my knees she's on my knees alafu ikakuwa nini so uh will i meet nini like this uh i'm assuming you've met uhuru you need obvious ah kibaki yes moi Yes. Yeah, okay. Moi akupa na tension ya uli chukua buda. Uli tesa buda. Yeah. No. And how was Moi as a like a person be ile time as same thing is I told you like when you're just with him and he's not Moi is Moi, yeah? yeah. Like you know there those guys you walk into a room with you feel their presence. Yeah. Yeah. Moi without a doubt. Mm. Yeah. Um Kibaki not so much Uru even less you know Uru is a guy of mm. a regular guy yeah, yeah. Moi was you see Moi and it's it's Moi very presidential yeah, he had that very big present yeah remember to give bonga to kisema there's a time to got naongea jua the Kenyans uh, Kenyan presidents and got nasema like Moi was the most presidential like yeah, we felt was. like he had 24 years of practice yeah <laughs> like he, it he reached, was if you say it that way yeah, he was yeah it reached yeah. a level where alikuwa like eh kulikuwa na hiyo presence the art mm. eh yeah, alikuwa me master baba na mama kan eh eh baba na mama na sasa hizi pia kuna baba na mama ha ni tena kwa dunia nani ni watu wao like all this azi uh mo mo you can meet alikuwa acha toka kwa president ama bado alikuwa president he was president yeah i think yeah yeah before when you meet kisumu city mm. i think was the first time i met you yeah like you you could you little fresh aga jalu ko ni ni cuz i found it like when you think about it was something so stupid you got to so so it when it's so so those days it was just like now you yeah. get more resources if you're a city yeah, yeah. So, oh yeah okay it's gonna do yeah yeah kuna kogana hiyo organized yeah. no job civil service comes in. it's now you're not talking of town clerk you're talking mm. of you're now a city oh na nakuru is a city right now yeah, it, it was made this year Made this year, isn't it? Yeah. Because I'm going to come back to So you get more resources, more whatever. Those days. Yeah. Na size? Because if Nakuru was made... See, there's you know? certain things you have to have. Like you have to have, for example, an international airport, things like that. Mm. So I'm sure they are planning to upgrade. Oh, yeah. Nakuru is an international airport. Yeah. Pia LDI, you know? It does, yeah. It's the, international. Yeah, I think it's the second busiest airport. Yeah. Mm-hmm. LDI? Ka- yeah, cargo. Yeah. For cargo. No, for cargo. cargo, for yeah. cargo. Yeah. Cuz for needs uh, Nairobi. Mm. For everything else Nairobi then coast. 
alafu sasa hiyo i think i'll do can do more than mombasa yeah well, in for terms of flights flight oh Could. yes Could. So, yeah I, but i don't know Yeah I think I need to skip to go to Ethiopia. Oh okay. Uh, and uh, Kenya like um travel places Ghana ga, because of politics she and kila pali na budako. Like places like Garissa she and. I've been everywhere. As someone born in the dynasty una feel like. Eh came right on. Cindy <laughs> Oje. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Aja sisi sit ko inje tu tunaangalia mkiwa kwa dynasty so na shindwa. Maisha ndani ya dynasty. What's the dynasty? Um, I think dynasty na semekana ni easy family tatu uh, first of all kuna, No what's the definition of dynasty a Dynasty is uh, a family ama families that run a kingdom So uh, okay, where Kenya now Kenya is a kingdom So Kenya is a kingdom now Yes 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 <laughs> and uh, in this scenario Kenya is a kingdom alafu ina run wana family as tatu okay. um, so kuna the Kenyatas kuna the Moys na kuna the Odingas, Odingas yes Well, I have told you the story so if, if that's a dynasty <laughs> you've heard about it mm. yeah. but dynasty is just you know it's like a group or a clan mm. as long as you have a kid that's your dynasty yeah. that's your legacy that's what dynasty means mm. um all over the world if you look at countries you're talking of like Japan you said mm. you've been to Japan no 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 we've not been like no, he's no, the one I'm encouraging yeah, to go yeah, to Japan yeah yeah this is step mom or something yeah yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. ask about the dynasty the longest in the world yeah. that was like 630 years BC before Christ mm, that's mm. how long they've been ruling mm, mm. uh they also have a prime minister and they have those sorts of elections mm, but mm. look where Japan is mm, look mm. at middle east <clears throat> uae qatar saudi arabia mm. look at how far they've gone mm, mm. um So it's not to say that I don't believe we're dynasties. Mm, mm. I, I, I certainly unless the Dinga one is a dynasty of just heart, heartache and pain. <laughs> That's not how a dynasty is. Um, yeah. I can speak only of the Odingas. Yeah, yeah. I'm an Odinga. Mm. If you go to Jaramogi's grave mm. right now in, in Bondo, in Nyamira Kamo, mm, mm. on top of his mausoleum it says freedom has a price. Mm, mm. And Jaramogi is the fulcrum of this day. Mm, mm. He came, he agitated, mm. uh, fought for freedom. Mm. When things went against his principles, he left. Mm. And that thing of principles, you know, after he left, people were saying, how can you leave being a VP? How can you talk mm. like that? How can you mess it up? Mm. But that's something he really brought down. You have to fight for what you believe in. Mm. Uh, this is what we believe in as a family. Mm. and these are our people and they have to have decent uh, ways of living mm. yeah so remember i told you this is something before uh, baba was born and it will be there after him yeah yeah if being in the pursuit of a better kenya mm. yeah would call me a dynasty then so yeah. cuz cuz nini pia last week tulikuwa na It was like a live we do like lives for Ikoni yeah, every Friday watch, yeah. every Friday night so during one of those lives there is someone who uh like called in mm. and he was saying like he feels like Kenyan families uh no Kenyan politicians enjoy poverty like they uh like they're happy when there is poverty and this has been said <clears throat> like against your dad like in Vile Budako kuna place ka kibich like ah umsel kwa mp kibich you for how many years akuna kitu alisaidia yeah. ina maanisha anapenda nini alafu on the other side wona sema uh, nairobi na fa so what, what's your view on that kuna wasana sama ga yeah. wasaki acha kusota watacha kufurahia budako yeah, i see what you're saying like um as well kibich is not the only slum in kenya mm. and as an mp everybody knows what you do with cdf bursary mm. bills whatever you can't make change mm. Uh, when he became a minister this housing program mm. uh, those sorts of things uh, so now when he's talking of free education till university mm. free healthcare that make sure that ulem sewa kibich has a few extra in his pocket could mm. idea to help himself build up yeah mm-hmm. so uh, these are policies that you have to do and you can only do it if you're in government mm-hmm. yeah there are people who don't believe in that but in a place like africa mm. even a country like kenya you put like countries like uh, small 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 countries and you're competing with china mm. india mm. Yeah? 
And those guys are telling you, you, why can't you feed your children? Why can't you feed your people? Why can't you do this? Why can't you whatever? Mm -hmm. But uh, they've set your countries up when they left after colonialism to fail. So the social structure, everything begins with basic human needs, water, mm. health, shelter, food. Um, that's what you have to get first. Mm. So when mm. you say, look, I take care of food, we'll give you housing, we'll give you education, we'll give you health care. Now you can focus on other things. Mm. You mm. know what I'm saying? Mm. But, um, But can you, is it promises you make before? So people wait, will be before like... Before you go to that thing, eh, eh. there was something you were saying about that dynasty thing. Yeah. Uh, uh, there's a, I get that tweet, I think, 60 times a week. Yeah. yeah. Uh. Like, you, why are you with your dad? Why are you following your puffs? You know, it's like, um, otherwise, what else would I do? Mm. Do you mm. see what I'm saying? Because mm. I say, like, who are dying to work with the president. Mm. So me, I'm leaving a president to go do what? <laughs> yeah, I go to <laughs> Patel and Sons. Uh. But that's another thing. Like, these um, communities that keep family in their business, I'm not saying politics is a business, yeah. Yeah. but uh, like Indians, yeah. the Jews, uh, Chinese, or even Somalis, yeah. mm. Mm. that's where wealth is. Mm. Mm. Yeah? Yeah, is. That's where the wealth is. That's how they build their communities. That's how they have their banks. That's how mm. the mm. wealth is able to be spread. But, but another way to look at it would be like there's so much love that comes with uh, working with your dad, um, uh, being with your dad. Then there's another uh, level of hate that also comes with that. Because yeah. I don't know if it's from the outside looking in, but for me personally, mm. when I look at your dad, I look at him, Evie. Kuna watu wana mpenda kabisa. Yeah. Na kuna watu wana mchukia kabisa. Yeah. Mm. Kuna watu wana mchukia level that even if they were burning and he was the guy with the bucket of water they'd rather burn. Yeah. You know there's that level of yeah, hate. Yeah, yeah. So kwa nini ufuate hapo? So cuz unajua nikifuata budangu kuna watu naturally mm. watanichukia mm. like chuki yeah. see si. yeah. So why when you jipele kayo area? I'd ask the other way. Why would mm. I leave? Ni mache why would I leave him there? Na uh, don't think ni mache na nani? Ule sister ko mwingine haiko active kwa politics even. No 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 she's been recuperating after she got sick. Yeah. But and which she also got a lot of hate. I don't know if you, you yeah, saw yeah, it. Yeah yeah yeah. I saw it but you see if you love somebody mm. and those are the things they face you don't leave them. Yeah? Mm. You don't leave them because your life will be easier. Yeah? That now you're hiding but and then your whole life your whole being Mm. is dependent on him yeah even when you go kuna uh, msema nakupea madhara then akisikia uh, then is like hey, you're given a little bit of shima here and there mm. everything everything begins and ends with Raila Odinga mm. for mm. for me yeah. and yeah. as a family mm. Mm. so uh, something i've also learned being with him is understanding his vision mm. of course that biased everybody Yeah, yeah, you know, listens to their parents. Mm. But then you go out there with him and you see what you're saying, the people that love him. Mm. Mil, you're talking of millions of people depend on him mm. to survive. Mm. So it's bigger than you. Mm. Yeah. So if mm. it means, so I just don't add a few companies to my CV, mm. then so be it. This is much yeah. more fulfilling. I love Pia, like one of the reasons tunafanya hii nini like sit down in uh, the live show. So Pia kwa the live show another thing that we spoke about and people are really passionate about was the ICT bill. Yeah. I don't know if you've heard about it and yeah, what your opinion was, uh, is. It's rubbish. I don't know the one that was sponsored Juzi. Uh, yeah, it's uh, total nonsense. In fact, I was with him. Mm. Luckily we were on a plane. Mm. So Uh, I went and sat with him like uh, I'm getting a lot of things about this ICT bill and mm, these are the mm. problems. Like I told you as a photographer, mm. I was self-taught. Mm. Uh, uh, f- things like Photoshop, I taught myself. Mm, mm. So to sell the work, you know, to say you have to be registered, like that, that doesn't make sense. Mm, everything mm. is digital. It's the basis of everything. Mm, so mm. you can't have a license. Even you, you're a creator. Yeah. Yeah? A chick who picks up a camera and a stu- ring light Mm. starts doing makeup that's a creator yeah so i told him and when i told him he's like yeah, yeah i've seen he was on his twitter mm. <laughs> he's like i've seen mm. uh, so i was like you know we can't we can't allow that mm. because mm. if we're talking about giving people we're taking care of basic needs mm. to give them the tools to do Survive. whatever they can yeah. then yeah. you have to allow innovation 
Mm. Yeah, innovation is the bedrock of this thing. Mm. So uh, so uh, kuna hiyo alafu pia I think ilikuwa leo niliona kuna mtu alikuwa anasema uh, ile kitu ngumu uh, people like your granddad and your dad waliletea ngagava ni mfanya Kenya si Singapore. <laughs> so you know feel you know feel that say and we check him say I'm saying evil like uh, like uh, grand budako alikuwa na stress Jomo <laughs> budako akakuja hapa ku stress moi mm-hmm. eh yeah, alafu afuta ku stress moi aka stress kibaki stress uhuru at say it ngekwa Singapore so. <laughs> yeah but anything good has to come out of a, a struggle yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. it's give and take mm. so everything good has to come from mm. a struggle point of view yeah yeah but you see you know something like you talk of china or even mm. places like singapore mm. i think it was lee kuan yew um you have these leaders who get the buy in of the people the support of the people sometimes mm. in some places they go too much mm. yeah a place like rwanda uh, you, everybody talks how clean it is mm. yeah mm. but the leader said it's this mm. and the people could see his whatever and they follow it mm. Mm. and uh, to some degree kenya needs that mm. yeah yeah we're not there but we're yeah. also not a unique case study Yeah. We're not the only country with many different tribes, many different people. Mm, mm. But we have to all put our effort into making it better. Mm, it's not mm. one guy. Mm, we mm. all have to do it. So mm. you need a guy who gives you a proper plan like A hey, you will do this. You you'll do this. You guys you'll do this. You guys will do this. So simultaneously you build something. Mm, yeah. mm. Oh, I think to my bongaji with uh oh this is what what the last thing and bongaji he came to politics ni african politics so for tilia sana eh uh, mm-hmm. so um any president that you admire like in africa like someone who you think is right now big moves yeah cuz of course kitambo kila mtu ongejwa sankara like do you feel yeah. like there's like a modern day sankara anywhere in uh, any country no not sankara yeah <laughs> but somebody i admire is uh, uh samia sulu mm. yeah mm. um uh, just <laughs> a lot of people are saying that's going to be strictly because of gender is there what has she achieved yeah so what achieving that as a woman is, <laughs> is impossible in this place yeah, like yeah, can yeah. you think any of us can stand even me when you're dinga mm. even i do dinga mm. can stand and will be elected the president mm. can't happen mm. yeah. Yeah, yeah so for you to be able to do, do that of course yeah, you didn't go through the election that way yeah yeah but be able to rally your people towards a cause mm, yeah mm. and being a president is tough you know yeah. that's why you need a guy who's gone to school like yeah you have to you have all these debts you have to go uh, debate with the head of IMF mm, can mm. you give us some relief you have to see what's coming in the future balance mm. the past what or what besides mm, these social mm. issues mm. it's tough uh, and that country is still afloat mm. yeah but that thing of where she's come from to be a respected world leader. Mm. I think that's something you can't ignore that for me. Things you'd change if you had to change anything like what would you change yeah for African politics ama uh what pieces you off because uh, apart from like yeah. preska Kenya tosema kuna tribalism imeshika mizizi kabisa uh it's yeah. part of our politics if that could change of course would be good but you know Kenya is countries... like a, a mini case study of Africa as a whole. Mm. Yeah. So in Africa we had colonialism the french british portuguese spanish german mm. so they divided us then when they were leaving they divided small 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 mm. like mm. france did that with the african union mm. Mm. that's why now like the recent heads of african union except mrs zuma mm. are all french speakers mm. they have more votes because they are more little 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 countries yeah, yeah. so when you're taking those countries you're taking a country like i was telling you like djibouti yeah yeah or Eswatini mm. and you're putting it on a stage against Russia yeah and you're telling you know you're comparing you're comparing gdps you're comparing uh, growth you're comparing everything mm-hmm. yeah that's not a fair basis to compare it on yeah because it's too small yeah the strength has mm. to come from the whole unit as a whole mm. it's the same way in Kenya when you take a tribe like Jemps mm. or one of these small small tribes mm. and you're saying you're going to put them against the big boys the kikuyus the kalenjins which is also an amalgamation of tribes the luos mm. when when will that person ever become a president mm, yeah mm, mm. so using tribalism 
like that or separating people like that is what causes just the fall. Like you don't develop that way. Mm, yeah. Mm. To say like you have a government, oh, you have to have the face of Kenya. Mm. But are they qualified? Are they studied? Yeah. Yeah. And how come you're not getting so many people from this area who have gone to university? Mm, because mm. they were not given primary schools. They were not given food. They were not given opportunities. Mm. You see that imbalance. Mm. So what you do is you, you bring everybody together. So Africa needs to put strength in the African Union. Mm, mm. So that when they tried it with this free trade agreement, mm. so that when these big boys come, I come to you, your country is Togo. I tell you, I want to mine gold or uh, whatever it is. Mm. And the Togo has cotton, I think. Mm. I want all your cotton. Mm. I'm China, for example. Mm. And you say, no, 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 I can't have that. I just go to Benin. Here, here's a hundred dollars. Mm. Give me your cotton. Yeah, so it's the divide and rule. But now you have so many countries. You have the EU, you have the US, you have India, you have China, you have Russia, all doing this, yeah, attacking at a different point. Mm. So now this free trade thing, what Africa has to do and also what Kenya has to do when we talk of unity, you don't come and negotiate with me, the president of Mali, president of Kenya, president of Namibia. Mm. You come and negotiate with Africa. And Africa will tell you, all right, you want some things? You can go there to Congo. You can go there. You can go there. These are our terms. This is when we bring it back. In fact, we don't even have to go borrow from you. We have our bank. Mm. Yeah, We have a bank. It's cheap. We'll get our money. We'll do it without you. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's, that's what Africa, if you oh, ask me, has okay. to do. Yeah. And uh, does your dad share the same vision of like, I think so. We think alike. Yeah. Okay. Zakwadini. <laughs> yeah. I love food. Uh, to kitok a politics. Goma. Um. What's the name? Goma. Hip hop. Yeah. Hip hop. What's the hip hop? Yeah. Yeah. I like hip hop and uh, like Afrobeat. Yeah. Yeah. So hip hop, like, who are your favorite artists? Uh, Both local and international. Uh, for international, like you know, Jay Z, Drake, mm. the usual suspects. Yeah. Um. Local. local, of course, Mbogi Genji. Yeah. I have to give my... Yeah, Mbogi Genji. Yeah, Mbogi yeah, okay. Genji. <laughs> <Bobby. laughs> yeah. Uh, but Mesema. I also like what Cardinal, I don't like. Yeah. Next to Mbogi Genji, you may come and you may jail. Yeah. yeah. I think it's dope. <laughs> it's, it's really dope. Uh, yeah. Calligraph. Yeah. Uh, Last month, you represent your bond, though, Cindy. Yeah, but yeah. even him, he has to represent your bond. Yeah, as Cindy was saying, like... <laughs> like Ohanga. Hmm? You said Ohanga. 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 No, you're Ohanga, you know? No. Nani, Okto. Okto's ah. real name is Ohanga. I didn't know that. Yeah, I love you. Okto pin number nine, Kibera number nine. Yeah, that one I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, there's a. This girl, she's an artist. She's called Rosa. Yeah. She's good. Mm. There's another mm. rapper, Kamba Boy, he's called Mbithi. Mm. Mm. He's yeah, yeah, Mbithi, really, really good. good. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. Um, good. Those are my artists, have that, actually. You've heard that new song, Happy. Yeah. I got all the songs. It's my boy, son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, like, you know, on that happy song, I think the girl killed them. Like, Femi, Femi, Femi one. one. Mm. Damn, that uh, first verse is cold. I, I As if they all had dope verses. Mm. But after your verse, yeah, I love mm. Kitumoja, she drops like this. It's a very simple line, but it's super dope. Mm. Uh, I don't know if you understood it where she says <laughs> Yeah, I got oh, that. Shit. Oh shit. Yeah. Like after it's one of those lines on a scale of like, eh. I challenge her Close. to a rap off, man. I'll do a cipher with her. Yeah. I'll wash her ass. <laughs> <laughs> but Femi was at the launch. Is Femi will go for launch? Yeah. But now you're talking as in lyrical skill. Yeah. yeah. It was. Okay, so I'm talking about Bondo and that was the best male rapper and, and the best female, female rapper, best ah, president, best, <laughs> best first daughter. <laughs> you can continue. Best ah, engineer. Z, Z, Z. Z. If you come to Nini, <laughs> if you come to rap, because uh, for me, I, uh, favorite uh, like uh, number one male rapper Kenya, Naik mm. Patiakali. Number one female right now. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's anyone messing with Femi one there's right one. now. No, no, no. There's uh, another girl. So, <sighs> you know, I try to fight. I don't know if I'm Femi would be. That would be a mistake. I'll go. Uh, you don't know what I can do. 
I don't know, but I know what she can do. Yeah. No. But you don't know what I can do. Yeah. Yeah. Femi umesikia jo. Alafu unajua kwanza tumekuwa tukitaki kutafuta Femi kwa hiyo badge. Maybe this is our chance. <laughs> Maybe yeah. Kwa nini unataka kuangusha freestyle? Unajua pia unasema. Kwa nini cipher, you know? Yeah. Bring some. Z Z. Okay. Can you spit anything? Do you have anything no, that I can spit? No, no. I don't want her to prepare. You it's going to mm. come out like a ghost. Yeah. <laughs> oh, cuz I'm, I'm sure she's ready. I'm, I'm sure, sure she's, she's ready too, man. Eh? Yeah. Yeah, she's dope. She's yeah. dope. Yeah. I can like I agree she's also one of my best right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. she's really good. You're just saying like hey, 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 I'm just saying like all this time those who know have been saying it. the hottest MC is mm. Kazi. Yeah. Now guys like you don't know mm. a sign say something crazy. <laughs> so <laughs> let's push in your booth. Push in your booth. I'll say no no you, you see it's one thing to see and be like I can do it it's another thing to record you, have you ever recorded even if it's unreleased are you crazy i have yeah. albums yes been yeah. in the booth man i've been reading yeah 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 so i got album na bonga jeni everything yeah i'll talk about you if you want oh cuz na jamiza kuna toa zile za of you like <laughs> I yeah, can survive pain like my dad did <laughs> some some ish. Hardcore up. Yeah, yeah but, but that's interesting yeah. if you didn't, I didn't know like you're like a part-time rapper. Nah, but you know what since I rap so yeah, yeah. I have to get ready. Yeah, like I used to use what English uh Shang Swa. Swa. Yeah, and some Jango. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. Cuz talking of Jango, there's that very new song and I doubt any of you have heard it the new song it was born yeah yeah anani yeah calligraph no i've not heard it yeah, yeah, I think so a few uh, on tiktok yeah, yeah so like the way cuz one, one thing i like about the dude is like he's master the technique of rhyming yeah the guy is yeah, just yeah. a genius so, with his words yeah so there's this where he rhymes nyuma with muanya you see it's just basically it's the same it's the song, same nini him rhyming kuk and i was yeah. like He was rhyming he did ra- he rhymed Jango Kyuk and I think English or Sheng yeah, in yeah. one sentence yeah, like it's yeah. brilliant yeah, but yeah. Uh, he did that also Kamba thing kwa ndovu ndovu ni ku yeah 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 even there he did the Kamba yeah, yeah. but if you're talking of uh, Jango that yeah. Rosa only one Rosa yeah. she has a song called Nyako mm. it's so cool how she's done it you know Oh. No, Jango music is nice. Cuz when you But talked about Rosa, really, I, yeah. I thought you were talking about this crazy TZ girl. What, what's a crazy TZ girl called? This is a crazy TZ uh, rapper. Okay, I don't know her. Also she has the she's name like, like, like Rosa, Rosa, eh? Like Rosa she's she's short hair. Yeah, 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 you know her. Yeah, the Maasai yeah, girl. Yeah, yeah, I know her. No do them. Mm. Some crazy ass nene yani. Nah. Ile like even when um, I don't know how you have your ears on the ground but there was this whole debate yeah uh, Diamond Mm-hmm. about uh, blasphemy because Diamond had shot a video with Zuchu alafu alikuwa kwa church uh-huh. so that video was banned and people was like or well, people were like eh hey, but video this other girl she was there with like a bottle of <laughs> In alcohol church. in charge because yeah. no it's it's art yeah. like we can't police yeah but you know art you, that much. you try not to offend with your art Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, I think that's you know by Pia Africa you don't feel like we're too stiff. Yeah, I think we're definitely too conservative. And then uh, we're conservative with culture that's not ours. Yeah, yeah. Uh, guys, let me not even go further. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Na nini ohangala unasikiza gana? Sana sana sana. Chade ginyundo. Yeah. Is it a bit too risky? Yeah, that one is that one's <laughs> bopping everywhere. Yeah, I think uh, Nisha is kia yo. But yeah, it's one yeah, of those yeah. things when you get older you like it better. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But she does like new school mm. with Django like even now she's talking about love. She's not talking like how those dirty songs are saying it. She's mm, it's mm. new school stuff. Oh, you be kwani ni jo. Like in yeah, this session to Kiasi ilianza late jo. Sera bit to irapa paraka raka. But hey, I'm surprised jo. Femi one. Umesikia? Challenge iko hapa jo. Eko nani? Eko nani? Mimi nitakuwa funk flex kwa hiyo nini? Si ndio unajua. Zako nde. One ones and twos. Alafu pia Omolo pia kwa tu in the building just in case. Eh, ama iko bondo against the world. That's it. Bring the two of us. Yeah. Bring you everyone you want. Yeah. Bring everyone. Uh, ever, ever met Kali? Yeah, Kali is my boy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so I'm kwa hapo tumko like bondo runs this shit. Eh? Yeah. We okay. just talk that stuff sana sa veve. Yeah. Some jabba kidogo. Yeah. We would say yeah, bondo, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So here we go ni uh, episode 101. Yeah, yeah, yeah iko nini? 101 102. 101 jo. Serious? Yeah, unajua we are 
finished no. a century of episodes so this is Excellent. you I started the new century bravo, of episodes bravo. asante sana this was a challenge that we threw out to uh and it was philip we didn't expect it to happen yeah. it's happened mkachina sisi historia rap ni mianza late poleni watu jo tutamtafuta siku nyingine jo nje ni mianza late sana jo kwa sababu na bidi tuarakishe tunaanza na hiyo rap alafu sa ndio pause on to be there yeah and you to malize jo so ndio sasa baga ekonene like subscribe hit the notification button stika wewe pia tuko si itabidi tu nini tuku graduateisha jo so atuko tunajua tukikuletea kala nyingine unaweza unza kataa so tukamwa tukuletea kala yako let me give you also some much eh much that cost nice no no this one now i can this one i can wait to the rallies Yeah, yes. Eh, hey, was it jo? Eko nene, wambia eko nene. Eko nene. Sindio jo. So like, subscribe, hit the notification button, tell yeah. a friend to tell a friend. Thanks guys. Uh, yeah. Ah, pia, thank you, thank you. Like <laughs> this is cooler than I expected it to be. Swiss kudanganya. Like niko like, eh, umto, yeah, umto yana ni jo si itako attention jo. Atakata hata zusha tunanduka jasho. Hygiene is you have to wear deodorant, eh? Yeah. Yeah, that's what Kenya men don't like to do girls are running away but that's why they in Nigeria you got to see the cost of the Nigeria look so hot last much we was a lendo as if funny enough i don't feel threatened by yeah, yeah. any like nigeria and, uh, yeah yeah because ataenda tu huko apate hate karudi tu hapa tu apate like sisi sisi tuna sisi <laughs> <laughs> you have a shoulder for you to cry on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you. Tukibalizia tukisema ekonene. Ekonene.